How do I get out of it? And why don't you simply tell Richard how you feel about it? No, that'd break his heart. Oh, I see. Well, we couldn't do that, could we? Suppose that I have a talk with Richard and uh, tell him that your mother and I feel that you're too young to be going steady. That's the coward's way out. Will you do it? I'll be delighted. <laughs> you know, Ross doesn't seem very happy. I'm worried about him. Oh, don't worry about Ross. We'll take care of him. I have a hunch that he feels he's being neglected. I promise you, he's not going to feel that way anymore. Good. I know sometimes he's inclined to show off a little bit, but that's the only way he can fight back. Fight back? Well, being the youngest member of a family can be very painful, particularly if you're a sensitive boy with an older sister. Now, we all get so busy with our own problems sometimes that we forget how important Ross's problems can seem. But all he's looking for is love and recognition. Well, he gets plenty of love, but... I'm not sure we've been giving him enough recognition. So I know I'm going to try a little harder, and well, I'm glad you're going to help. Well. Good morning, Richard. Not anymore, is it? What happened? Everything. Oh. <laughs> Patty had a quarrel. It wasn't even a quarrel. She interested in some other guy? Well, with some other guy, I can handle it. I lost her to a tuba. You don't understand. Patty suddenly got this thing for long-haired music. Since she joined the school orchestra, she's got that silly tuba wrapped around her all the time. Sorry, Richard. I'm afraid I'm on Patty's side. I'm delighted that she's taken up a musical instrument. That's very pretty, Kath. Don't you like sad music? Kath, forgive me for butting in, but I gather there's a boy you're rather fond of, right? Well, now, you take it from me. A girl as attractive and bright as you are can have any young man that she goes after. It's very sweet of you to say so, Uncle Martin. Well, that's true. The, the only thing is that, well, sometimes you have to, uh, what's the expression? You have to come on strong. Come on strong? Well, no, it doesn't do any good to moon in a corner, does it? See, I think you should let this boy know that you think he's wonderful. Be open and direct. Patty, a lot of dreams in life don't work out the way we hope they will. But that doesn't mean we have to stop dreaming. Then you're not angry with me? No. Wait, you almost accomplished a very rare feat. For a while there, I actually thought you were going to start a business with no assets, no capital, and no experience. That could have set a very dangerous precedent. I love you, Papa. 